So in 2012, for the first time, we combined a chaperone with an enzyme replacement product, Lumazyme, in adults stable on Lumazyme with Pompe disease. It was a single dose study. We looked at safety, of course, but we also looked for the first time to see can we alter the pharmacokinetic profile of Lumazyme, meaning can it be in a more active form and it can, be, can it be in the body longer? And we also took biopsies from those patients to see do you get a greater amount of enzyme into muscle tissue? And what we saw is at all doses, a change in the PK profile of the enzyme. And at the highest dose of the chaperone, we saw increased tissue uptake. So it was terrific proof of concept for us that we can indeed have a change in the profile of the enzyme replacement product. What we're now doing beginning in the fall of this year is a phase, another phase two study combining our proprietary chaperone in Pompe disease, AT2220, with the current standard of care, the enzyme therapy, Lumazyme. We're putting that into a multiple dose study in patients with Pompe disease, and we're doing it with various doses of our chaperone, looking to extend that proof of concept, to extend safety, and to better understand the molecule. I think it'll be a strong proof of concept for the chart platform with positive data. We expect that data throughout 2014, but also we think it will strongly enable the use of AT2220 in a formulation with our own proprietary enzyme product in Pompeii, which we've been developing for some time now. And over the course of the next several months, we hope to have some pretty exciting data to share about our own proprietary enzyme therapy things that we've done to make the enzyme itself better, like potentially engineering out epitopes that are known to elicit an immune response, improving the glycosylation and the targeting to the amino 6-phosphate receptor, which is critically important in treating Pompe disease, as well as adding the chaperone to enhance stability and reduce the immune profile of the product. Um, so lots going on in our Pompe program, both into and through the clinic over the next year, as well as the work we continue to do in our science labs to build that next, we think and hope, better product and better offering for patients with pump.